hey guys welcome back to my channel um i've been thinking about doing this for a while and the opportunity has finally come for me to do it so i am going to be taking you guys with me to work and part of the reason why i've decided to do it now is because tomorrow night will be my last night at this job so i figured hey why not take them to work with me let you guys see a little bit of what i do and yeah um, so it's Sunday night. By the time you guys watch this, it will probably be Monday evening. I'm going to try my best to edit tonight and um, tomorrow when I get to work. So yeah, we're going to be going to work soon. Um, my night shift was from 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. And then tomorrow, Monday morning, I will also be going to work my day job, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. So we're going to spend like 16 hours together, guys. Um, well, it'll probably be more like 10 minutes for you guys, but I'm going to take you guys with me on a 16 hour shift or 17, whatever. Um, yeah. And then maybe we'll get into surviving a night job, the pros, the cons, how I ended up working a night job, would I do it again? Um, yeah, but I'm excited because I am not a person that likes to work on Sundays, but um, when I was hired for the shift, I was told it was Monday through Friday, but being that it was overnight, it was Thursday night, I'm lying, Sunday night into Thursday night. So I had Fridays off, Saturdays, you know, Fridays and Saturdays off. Um, yeah, um, there's going to be a shift change. So unfortunately, it's going to conflict with my day job. So that is going to be why I am leaving. So this is my last Sunday working and I'm not even going to just say my last Sunday working a night job. My last Sunday working in general. Sundays are for self-care. Sundays are not for work. Sunday, Sundays are for self-care. The only time you guys may ever catch me working Sunday is if I'm helping one of my friends or families with their business. And something's happening on a Sunday. Or if it's my business. Or my ventures or anything like that. And it's a Sunday. Other than that, I am not punching no one's clock corporately <laughs> on a Sunday all right um yeah so let me start getting dressed because again I have to be there at 11 um so I'm gonna start getting ready and um probably most of the videos that I most of the footage that I capture tonight is going to be um just video and I'll probably just do like voiceovers because I don't want to make things weird recording at work you know one of the secrets I would say to working nights, or I guess I would say one of the tips would be um, try to stick to your night routine as closely as possible, even if you're going to work. So what I mean is eat dinner. I know some people who work overnight, they eat at work or they bring food to work or eat. You know, me, I like to eat before I go to work, preferably by eight o'clock, nine o'clock the latest. Um, one, because I don't want the food sitting heavy on me. Two, is because I know when I go on break, I'm going to want to take a nap. So I'd rather just eat at home. So I could also brush my teeth and stuff before I get to work. Um, What else? I personally don't do my whole skincare routine at night. I tried it, but it's like... I mean, if I do it early, like 6 o'clock or something, yeah. But if I don't, it's not that big of a deal. Um, But also try to make sure you take like your nightly vitamins that you would normally take if you were home. Um, but if you take anything like melatonin, don't, don't take that when you're trying to go to work. But like, I take like my probiotics. Um, uh, what else do I take? Just mainly that, but I bring my morning pills with me as well. So when I'm getting ready to get off, I take my morning pills. Um, but yeah, do whatever you would normally do. Shower, get ready, feel good, smell good, you know? Um, just so you could be comfortable and you could feel as normal as possible. Um, so yeah, let me start getting ready, as I mentioned before, and then I'll be back with you guys in a second. So this is what I'm wearing today. I'm just going to wear my blue scrubs. And <clears throat> these are from um, the brand Healing Hands, I think. And they're actually really good, really stretchy, really comfortable. So I like them. So this is what I'm going to wear tonight. 
promise y'all when I broke this, it was too big. Now, look at it. Look at me. Cody. Could you focus on me? You don't want to focus. What's up? Alright. Although I do not work a job when I'm on my feet all night. Thank God. Because I've been there, done that. and mm -mm. Um, I still wear compression socks to avoid swelling. You know, because normally when you sleep, your feet is up for like eight hours or however long you sleep. So since I gotta work, I'm just sure to wear my compression socks. And I also bring a pair of fuzzy socks with me because it's cold in there. But after this video, most likely you'll get a what's in my bag, like what's in my work bag for the night job or what I pack for the night shift or something like that. And I'll tell you guys all the essentials for working nights that you should have with you. If you never worked like a night job or something before, this video will help you. Well, the next video will help you that I might do this week. I was gonna show you guys where my locker is because it's like all the way in the basement, like in the dungeon. But I don't remember my locker number, so clock then gonna go upstairs and try to get some footage for you guys it's 11 10 two minutes late but i clocked in 11 07 i think or 11 08 i don't know it's in the last clip but let me go work i don't think i remember my locker number but this is where my locker is uh, all the way down here in the basement i thought i had a hair side in my bag but i don't but still let me attempt to side my hair because I hate my hair like when I get the braids and stuff. I don't like my hair being all out with samples around and everything like that. I was gonna wait till I get on break and sit down and talk to you guys. But um, I do work in a microbiology lab. So yeah, I don't want my hair out and around with the specimens. So I'm gonna tie my hair up, so. break now so now i take off my mask come in and break room with my phone and that's one of the perks of working nights um no one's on break but you um okay so i'm gonna show you my little setup so i make sure i grab me some clothes i'm actually tired now that it's two o'clock all right so first things first i'm gonna close um of the blinds because I feel like people be watching me sleep. I don't like that. There they go. They go. Close those up boys all the way. And it makes it warm in here. So I'll be acting like this in my room, y'all. Alright, so that's closed. Got the the good old hospital wipes. If you know you know. So take like two. Y'all gonna think I'm crazy, but just let me put you on a different table. Hold on. I, I like this table because I got the charger next to me. I mean, the socket, my bags right here. upstairs first because I want like a snack or something well <laughs> I'm gonna go upstairs to get some tortitos because that's what I be coming to work for um but yeah we're gonna go upstairs first there's a mini store which I think is very very um accommodating to the employees who work overnight um much better than the snack machine but 
I'm gonna get my mask and stuff and then we gonna go upstairs. <laughs> I told you guys that I'll do a what's in my work bag tomorrow. But I just honestly just want to go to sleep right now. I got my scarf because one thing I'm going to do is bring a scarf. <laughs> it's cold. It's always cold. What I'm doing right now. So my blanket from Delta because it's again freezing in here. So I got my blanket. Got my fuzzy socks. Can't go wrong with fuzzy socks. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Okay guys, so now it's time to change out of my scrubs and stuff, freshen up and head to um, my day job. Of course, I'm going to get some breakfast and stuff first. Um, I'm not drinking coffee. I gave it up for Lent, um, but I'm probably get like a matcha or something. And yeah, so let me show you guys how I freshen up. And yeah, 7 o'clock. I gotta be over 8 o'clock. So I like to take these pads to put, take one to put my bag on. Um, and then this has like my, the rest of my clothes and stuff in it. Um, and then I have a second one to stuff on the floor and stuff it on the bottom floor. Okay, so this is my little pouch of stuff that I have. Toothbrush, toothpaste, mouthwash. Um, I have my touch of face wash, moisturizer, my facial spray, deodorant, of course. I have a cloth on touch my face. And I use my own filter water that I have. Perfumes. And these. You guys have never seen these before. I suggest getting them. They're brand new. They look like flush and bath wipes, but they also make shower wipes. I have to get these things are not working out or anything. Like they're really good. Literally. Get these. Um, so to my day job get breakfast again like i mentioned and yeah so um this may be the end of the vlog um be sure to like comment and subscribe again this i was working in the microbiology lab um yeah i'm going to work now um for my privacy reasons i won't give too much details but i do work in sports medicine for my day job and yeah so that's why i'm here now so i'll see you guys in the next video I'm here, working. <laughs>